Commander. Hey everybody, welcome back to XCOM's Operation Mountain Steed. This is a very important mission. Uh, since the last time we had the opportunity to extract Advent supplies, we watched Lost and Advent battle a bit, and I was like, I don't... I didn't see a way that we could necessarily do anything with it. And... Yeah, so I was like, well, we left. <laughs> it was uneventful. So I'm really hoping that we can turn this around. Now, it's enemy material, so I imagine we're getting supplies, alloys, maybe even Illyrium, uh, if we can get any of the crates. It is a Lightning Strike Phalanx Savage Trio sit rep. So Savage can be, um, funny enough, Stun Lancers, uh, Chrysalids, um, Berserkers, I think, maybe? Uh, any, any, like, any beasts. Plus Stun Lancers is the point. Um, so we'll see. I am going to take out the Hound and Variable. Uh, she's got the Stalk ability. Wait, where is that? Stalker. So we can really reduce her detection radius. And we've got the Hound, who's got Shadow Stacks that build. And to do reduce his detection radius that way. Both wearing civilian disguises to further reduce that. And then uh, we also have Ghost, Jenkins, Libby, Short Fuse. Uh, we've got the Siam here. The, basically, the feedback that I got when we tried that last mission was that we're supposed to try and go and snag a few crates and then get out. And it's not supposed to be a big battle. Um, so I'm going to try that, but I don't know how we're going to do it. <laughs> Good luck to everyone. Uh, I wish you the best of luck out there. You can do it. I believe in you. I'm excited. I, if I can come home with like a couple of crates, I'd be stoked. Today's log comes from Procrastination Panda, who writes for Thomas Nova Steel. This is from episode 37, Banished Sky. I set up a shooting competition between me and the new Lieutenant Ghost. She beat me, but not by much. But she did beat me. If I said my pride wasn't hurt, however, I'd be a liar. Maybe my age is finally catching up to me. N no, no excuses. I can complain all I like when we finally kick Advent off our world. Maybe I should buy a pipe. What? Weird. Scatterbrain. Speaking of sniper battles, uh, Tyrant's aim is now over 100. I, I want to say it's... I want to say it's 103. Maybe. It's over 100. Our latest intel suggests Advent ran into problems while airlifting supplies from a secure depot okay. in this area. Let's see if we can pull this we off. We have an opportunity here to take advantage of their delay. Locate their supply crates and tag them with our transponders. Firebrand will pick up the signal and snatch the cargo. Advent forces are in the process of airlifting so a number one. of supply crates out of this area. And we have an opportunity here to take a few for ourselves. Locate and mark the crates with transponders, and Firebrand will handle the rest. I just realized, <laughs> perhaps a bit too late, that, uh, I mean, when we tag stuff, we're going to get revealed, right? So, it's actually fine for our Reaper, because we have Vanish, where at the beginning and end of the turn, if nobody can see us, we can re-enter concealment, so we could try to use that. But for somebody like... Uh, variable that's not going to be an option so if she reveals then we're in trouble because we can't we can't uh, reconceal I just re I just thought of that <laughs> okay uh okay well, let's see how this goes. Hound, you might have to do most of the work here, but let's start scouting. We already have action. Berserker. A, a golden. A golden berserker, if you will. Um, okay. Let's see if we can get a little closer here. So his detection, notice, there's only one tile, basically, which is pretty good. You know what? I might just keep these guys up on this high ground. I think that makes sense. On the move. 
Uh, Chen, you can take the full. Ghost, take this. Uh, Jenkins. Let's put you here. And variable. Okay, so look at her detection range here. God, her mobility is insane. Wow. Uh, so they have a detection radius of two. If I turn this on, literally invisible. So that's actually, that's actually, okay. That's something. Let's send her this way with stock. We'll overwatch these guys. Oh no. Well, he's he's got no detection range anyway, so that should be fine. Grenade to blow up this car. Ooh, chrysalid crawler and a shield bearer. Yeah, see, I can walk right by them. The, the, the problem with her is that she's going to be in trouble when she reveals, right? Because she just can't reconceal. I'll put her here. Yeah, I have to think about this, how I'm going to do that with her. He's totally invisible now as well because of his shadow stacks. 10% for each active shadow stack, plus we have the... the um, disguise. Silent killer, I need to have enough shadow stacks to reconceal after a kill. Uh, but vanish and fade don't have a shadow stacks requirement, right? Oh. So in, I can go right in here. There's no detection. Your daughter. The Reaper is definitely the right class to be bringing on these missions. But I can't tag anything yet. Either. So, yeah. Um. Actually, hold on. Do I want to fight? Do I want to fight this group right now? These guys would retain their concealment. You know what? I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna just wait a second here. I'm just gonna wait a second and see how everybody acts. Uh. Hunker down. And end the turn. Just let's just chill here. We're still in full concealment. Chrysalid bleeders. An alien patrol. Yeah, I, did, I don't even know if I mentioned... Did I mention chrysalids with beasts? Because that obviously makes the most sense. And with him... Okay, so same thing. Okay, so this is, this is interesting. Um, nobody can see him right now. Nobody can see him. Uh, they could possibly see her. So I'm gonna I'm gonna try it. If I reveal here like this, we're picking up a steady signal from the transponder. Firebrand. That's not is okay. Okay, yeah. The they're not they're not running at us because of him nobody sees him right yeah so because this broke the other guy's concealment too and now if i trigger her they're going to be live and they could come towards her actually but i'm going to be okay with that i think reinforcements in three turns so now i got my squad here um, Berserker, pretty much we know what he's going to want to do. So I could place this. 
Um, over here? That's one thing we can do. <laughs> and then... Oh, can we kill these guys? This would be nice to kill because of the, the ability, but there's just... There's, there's, there's two, so... Who knows? How can you not see anything here? This might actually... We might actually be able to pull that shield bearer. Order. Hold on. Yeah, I could pull him. He's got so much armor, though. And then, like, I still need to pump damage in here. We do have the soul merge to grant another action. Almost wonder if I should take this shot to build up some heat, then do the pull after a soul merge. Yeah, let's do that. We have nothing Soul to merge, fear. grant the action. I think he gets he gets other boosts, right? What else does he get? Persistent stat boost. Yeah, so ten aim. Uh. Did he get three armor from that? Where is it? I only have release soul merge now. Bonus action, persistent stat boosts. It's got mobility. Sigh. You are judged! Yo, you know what I should have done? I should have, uh... Oh, good crit, dude. Wow. No tissue damage. I should have done that a little differently. <laughs> should maybe have taken that shot with Ghost. Because it has armor pierce. He'd be dead now. Then we would still have to deal with this. But he would at least be dead. Well, we'll see. I also have teamwork. Oh, wow. Okay. 83 could do it. This is more likely. I think I kind of messed up my order of operations here a tad. Let's put this on the Berserker. place this. I can place this up to one away. If I'm on this, I can place it across from me, I think. Which I could use to pre prevent this guy. Whatever you say. Or at least hinder him, because he's going to come up, right? And then run at this group. I'm hoping Short Fuse can then get this kill. Nice. Are we looking nice. for this? Impressed yet? Okay, advanced speed, basic bedded stock. I will draw it closer. He's gonna reconceal. I can put some damage on here. This guy still is definitely gonna be active. Ooh, the poison though, that could that could make a big difference. It's gonna impact his aim. And because of the flank, she's got reposition, which I will do. I'm going. I don't think I wanna trigger these guys. Yeah, I don't I'm gonna wait here on this crate. Don't think I'm going to trigger this. You've already marked. 
you have to stay here so you can reconceal. I do have an emergency reconceal as well. So I think I'm just going to end the turn here. You can hunker, I guess, just in case. My position is and the same for you. Yeah, okay, so he's reconcealed. Okay. Man, if I had like a couple of roof if I had a couple of Reapers, that would be cool. How is he no longer poisoned? Thank you, wow. That's great. He just shook that poison right off, didn't he? Yep. Crate, crate. Enemies. Ooh, more enemies. Whoa. Firebrand is on deck for recovery. Keep marking those crates, Menace 1 5. We got crates over here. Okay, so I'm. Okay, I think. What ultimately needs to happen is that is that um, a Reaper seems essential for sure, but I need to make sure that I'm with outside of their visual range so that I can tag it and get my free reconcealment back. Right? This gives me a vision of who. Okay, now it says none. Uh I can cover it. Wait, it is saying one. Yeah, it says it says I don't see any. Short fuse is stunned. Gotta love that. Reinforcements are coming in. I could actually take this shot and bring him up. Man, dude, does he really not see anyone here? I guess not. But if I take that shot, then maybe he messes up his um, his aim there. Actually, just build up some stacks with him. Their service is over. I have no more ammunition. I don't see a confident way that I can tag this unless I just tag it and literally start running. Because these guys are going to be like, hey, what's up? And this crawler, he could possibly get to me. But I've got her out here. It's probably only going to get worse. I'm doing it. And plus, I can turn stock off as well. And she'll have even more mobility. Yeah. Well, stock is off, obviously, on its own. Trying to snag a couple of crates. These guys are in. These are guys are hidden. They are compromised. That's cool. Ready Libby, reload. Engage. We'll have uh, reinforcements are imminent. Scanning. Scanning. Reconceal. Okay. Oh god! Would I ever love to get another Reaper now? Just for these missions. That seems like a really cool combo, but we still have to be cautious. Just there lifted out their first crate. We're gonna have to move fast if we want to get the rest. We still have to be cautious. Oh, downtown. Oh, nice shot. Nice shot. Who's keeping score? Probably should have did that first. 
Okay, these guys are dropping in front of us. That's nice. We're already doing significantly better than we did on our first reinforcement attempt. Um... Libby here. Short I'm fuse down. here. Jenkins, uh, reload. reload. Tarani up. We're going to overwatch these guys coming in. Uh, quick hands lets me use stuff at yeah snapshot distance. So I'm actually gonna reload. Let's rock. Oh. Oh, whoops. Never mind. I screwed that up. Great. That's awesome. Attacking on sight. Okay, now what? I don't, I don't even see anything. I need more crates. Or do I? I am trusting you. Oh, here's one. Oh, we saw something there. Not sure what. Okay, so we don't see anyone. There's another crate up there. Let's do the same thing. He's revealed, but he reconceals at the end of our turn. Holy smokes. Five? Five enemies? One guy was like waiting for him. We've got Advent here. Please kill the purifier immediately. Blow up the rest of the squad. I don't know if we're gonna have any damage. Okay, uh, medic, I guess, is an option. The poison, very nice. Oh, God. He might die. I don't know how much health he has left. If he has one, we're good. He has two. It's possible he dies. These guys should all be overwatching. On reinforcements or defensive options. I guess the shield guy could put up a shield or something. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's good for you. Oh, hi. Holy crap. I got eyes on Advent troops. That was the chrysalid shield bearer coming in. And more reinforcements coming. Okay. Okay. I could try and get to that. Or if I blue move this, I could maybe even get two. I already have four. I go where you tell me. Okay. You just don't know where enemies are. A, these are really close. I'm going to see if I can get lucky here. Yes. Okay. Now, what do we got here? Obviously, a fuse option is decent. kill all of these guys? This group's gone. Or far enough away, I should say. Oh, here. Start blowing things up. Grenade out. I should try and deal with the shield bearer first. Dude, 
Did we not? Oh yeah, the shield. Um, be nice if this could finish him. Not quite. There you go. That's nice. That's nice. Shield removed there. This guy still has a shield. Don't love that. Because he likely... He likely grenades us and puts us all on fire. Right? Uh, but now I might be locked in here. What does more damage? Two to three? Yeah. Our shot, definitely. But then do I kill him? Because I'm going to probably take this shot on the Lancer. I know he's poisoned, but we don't know how much damage he's going to take from this. Can I hit both? No, of course not. He is poisoned for a long time, but if he does land his attack, he could stun us. What's my other alternative? I just blast this guy, or I, I shoot over here to blast the purifier, but then this guy has grenades as well, so it's kind of like... Can I maybe get to the... Oh, hold on. Can I get any visual from here? Yes. A useful aid. Then I can at least use his other shot. We have a bunch of armor, so it's fine, but... Yes, look at the heat level. Let's justice this guy. Big crit, baby. Oh, he's one health. Damn. Okay, so now... I'm gonna try this. Um... Let's, let's leave the poison on this guy. Let's throw this damage here. On the, way. on the purifier. Man, we're so close to getting, like, really clutch lands here. That trooper needs to die. We have access to this guy. I got two shots. I'm relying on leaving this Lancer here. That's a 99. This is an 85. Actually, oh, this doesn't actually improve my chances. Nice. Do you see that one? Now we have a reposition, but I'm not going to do it. out here. Oh, he only took the one. Let's see what happens to him off this. There's another crate back here. That's probably not workable. Okay, not that bad. Let's see what the Lancer does. Oh, of course. Of course he would. Multiple hostiles advancing on our position. Okay, I wonder now. Okay, there's two left. Over here, there we saw that group, so I probably can't even do anything versus that. Let's blue move here. Oak says I am to obey. Let's 
take a look. He might be able to get this. We have known to them. But like we're getting absolutely overwhelmed here. Even if I kill this, we have another group coming in. We have this guy here. I do have uh, teamwork availability. And vice versa. This might sting a little. I wonder if maybe what I should do, because we're totally concealed over here, right? He's going to reconceal. That's fine. Then we should uh, maybe, what if we, okay, maybe we evac. Maybe we evac this group. And, he, and then he just runs in like totally, totally stealth, right? and evacs out is that not the play here because we clearly this is not meant to continue fighting all like they're just gonna be pummel us evac now! yeah we have to we have to extract all XCOM soldiers anyway no problem boss Might as well use all my stuff. Take this. I think that's our play. Kill him. You come in. Libby comes in. No problem, boss. Uh Here I come. Ghost comes in. And then variable I don't know. Maybe I maybe I could keep fighting. I don't know. I don't know. I'm gonna evac going. these guys. I just feel like if he's got full concealment here, where he literally can't get detected. This one too. <laughs> There's one crate left. Do I do it? I mean, yes. We saw that group over there though. But yeah, okay. Good work. Advent's locator is down and our transponder is active. Firebrand will handle the pickup. Um. Let's go. Wow. Okay, cool. Just look at that. I wonder if there's a maximum to the number of shields that they can give, or if it's just literally anyone in their bubble. I still have an emergency reconceal as well, in case I screw something up here, but hopefully that doesn't happen. spotted an alien patrol yeah see like look at this is absolutely bonkers that has to be the idea L like literally a smash and grab right 
if I could, uh, if I could have Life two reapers to do this, I might be able to get more crates. I think I need to be nervous because we're basically undetectable, right? I'm just Moving has ordered. still nervous. <laughs> I'm still concerned. I am at your service. I really wonder how many, how many, uh, we're gonna get out of this. This could be so huge for us. They have a patrol moving here. Whoa. They're on the objective. I'm super happy with that. Super happy. 29, 4 for 4 on Ghost. Jenkins, 34, 7 for 8. Variable, 13, 3 for 3. Hound, great pose. Sneakiest, obviously. 230 tiles. Libby, 24, 4 for 4. Short fuse, 21. And Wang Tang. So, I think we could have maybe done another round there. But then... Reinforcements come in, they add shields or they overwatch, right? For equipment upgrades. Initial reports that the suspension of services were the result I feel like activity Maybe maybe if we didn't bring uh Daniel, we had like more firepower. Maybe like a marine or something. We could maybe fight more too. Tide has turned. Yeah, I hope so. Successful shots hundred. very happy. I want to see what the rewards are because we got a lot of crates there. I think I think it's balanced around trying to get like four or five crates generally. Bravely wounded there. Okay. Now, I've been taking this on everyone, and I think I'm going to continue doing that. I like, like, I'm, I'm thinking about big robotic enemies that are going to be very challenging. If we can apply rupture to them, that's that's massive. Um, we don't have acid bombs yet, so that's why I've still been using the plasmas. But we're, we're working on those. Oh, yes. Oh, and we got some... Oh... Whoa, what a big mission. 173 supplies, 63 alloys, 33 crystals, Psy reanimation, which we actually already have, which is fine. That's cool. Stasis shield, which is really good. Can be cast on allies, rendering them immune for any attacks that's done for one turn. So it doesn't look like I can use this on enemies. If I think back to when we had actual Psy ops, I think that was like a secondary skill. Superior wildcat cartridges as well. Oh, this is our first time seeing this. So the the uh, the basic is 50% chance to deal one extra damage on crits. The second is 100% chance to deal one extra damage, but there's a trade-off in the, sh the shots can graze or something like that. 8% chance to graze. And superiors, are, they remove that, that negative. Cool. Advanced mobility. Man, that's, that's like a, that's a, that's a big hole for us. 
That's a big haul. Inspirational. What a good day. That's good. that's a good trait, right? <laughs> what a good day. Mm, where are you? This list is longer than it's ever been. This unit can experience sudden flashes of tactical inspiration, giving them an ability point by random chance. Oh, an ability point. Oh, okay. I mean, yeah, that's cool, I guess. That is, I mean, it's cool. Don't get me wrong. Not I guess. It is cool. So, um, we're running more experimental psionics in here. Uh, the last chip that we got... So we actually have a bunch of things sitting right now. Um, advanced conditioning, advanced speed we just got, advanced focus, and conditioning plus one. These PCS chips, in addition to giving us that skill, that solace, for example, this is where we start boosting Psy offense, which will help the psionic skills that rely on having a higher Psy offense. I'll probably end up giving these to uh, field medics and to Templars. Right? So, that makes sense. Oh my god, 175 supplies right now. What do I even do with all this money? Can I build the shadow chamber? Construction of this shadow chamber should allow I'm us still, to better I'm break down and analyze for the all the alien chamber. artifacts and data we've been recovering. Um, I have Illyrium in 37 hours. Um, trying to think of the best way to spend this. Like, probably just guns. <laughs> probably just guns. Right? If this was done, maybe it, maybe the training center. I, I would love to have a training center. Um, yeah, I mean, I need a training center at some point. I can't believe it's been so long we still don't have it. But, at the same token, it's like... It's not as crucial, in my opinion, as all of the other ones. Um, it's not as crucial. Shadow Chamber has to go here for the power, right? Like, I'm not considering putting other stuff. I'm just thinking about if there's other ways I could do this to fit more stuff. Because, like, I'm only going to have two things available, and one of them is going to be the training center. The other one is either going to be a lab or resistance comms or defense matrix, which isn't a bad option. We haven't had the Avenger been assaulted yet. Um, but that's always possible. So having those turrets could be huge. This thing's almost done. So we'll have tactical analysis. This will be interesting to use. Enemies activated on the XCOM turn will lose one action on their next turn. So, yeah, it's neat. I have 82 intel. Um, I'm maxed out on contacts, but we have the relay here. If I can complete this, we'll have mental fortitude. So all battle madness, panic, obsession, berserk, shattered even, only last one turn. Um, might be worthwhile to reconfigure this a bit. Maybe this is what I should upgrade. It's only 100 supplies. It's using our two remaining power, which I can't do anything with two power anyway. Oh, wait. Whoa, 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 whoa. Not resistance orders. Oh, that could have been bad. Yeah, right. We have an empty slot. Okay, I'm losing it. I'm losing it. I'm losing it. I'm gonna do this. Okay, so I got two extra resistance contacts. This is the one I was looking at upgrading. I need four power, so there you go. Answers that question. Um, I could get extra power here too, but now I need to keep this going. Advanced explosives, when that's done, I might move uh, an engineer over there. Uh, how many people do I actually have injured right now? Three days, three days, 16 hours, 13 days. 
This is the best our barracks has looked in a long time. Once these two are done, I'll shift I'll shift our infirmary worker. I'll I'll reconfigure these a little bit and we'll uh we'll go back into digging. But this is nice because I can make contact and I can get this continent bonus and increase our income even further. There's the elder's assassin. Hard at work. Located. Okay. Mental fortitude. It's not bad. It's fine. Munitions expert. Experimental ammo projects in the proving ground are completed instantly. So that's nice. Not a huge priority. Um, I'm curious to see what this will be. Machine learning. This is fine. It's really only helpful super early. Uh, remember, we are scanning for... Uh, where is it? Into the fire? No. Here. Hunt the hunter. Uh, seven days remaining. And then I, I literally as soon as this is available, unless some other crazy stuff is happening, we're going in. And we're taking it down. So, Okay, I'm over here, but I need to basically fly away for a second. And then this will this will max out, right? So, let's just go here. Setting course for the Mexican Regional Tract. I don't know if you guys will recall, but some of you might find this interesting. When, uh, one of the first times we, we infiltrated to the max, uh, I think it was, actually, I think it was on the squad wipe mission. Yeah, on the, yes, it was. It was the squad wipe mission. Um, when we had infiltrated, just because of the way that time moved, we were far away, and then by the time we got there, we technically were at 254%, and it didn't drop the chance of the, the Chosen. Um, that was apparently a bug in CI. And it's not... It's nobody's fault. There's tons of stuff happening here. Um, but because nothing was built in to ever go over max infiltration, it doesn't let you even go to the Geoscape when you're at 250% infiltrated. You just go straight to that mission. Uh, because nothing was built in for that, it didn't apply the, the decreased chance of the Chosen showing up because we were technically over the 250, which is kind of interesting. So I, I'm sure they've fixed that by now, but uh, just a little piece of trivia. And there we go. Just like I was saying. Uh, max infiltration. So this will be our next mission for sure. I'm excited about it. Uh, this is a, a pretty good squad here, right? We got Nova, Cook, Stephanie, Leda, uh, our, our new skirmisher with all the skirmisher gear. Uh, our Marine here. Do we have the... Yeah, we've got Null Ward and Null Lance on Stephanie. Um, so this... I hope, hope we can pull this off. This would be great because... This gets us into raiding a supply convoy. And I... Previously, when we took this, I was confused. Okay? I was like... I was thinking this was going to be a crate extraction thing. But the previous one that we just did is obviously that. Um, raid supply convoy is going to be like the one that we did... Uh, previously where we... I think we blew up one of the... One of the supplies uh, that were out there. So, we'll have to... Hopefully, if we can pull this off... That's going to be really huge for our economy. Like, really nice. And I'm looking forward to it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this one. Um, if you have any other advice on how to tackle those supply raids with the, with the crates, let me know. But obviously, a Reaper is so crucial. Like, that's honestly insane. Um, negative, <laughs> negative concealment. Um, uh, you just, we have to wait till nobody sees them and then you reconceal them at the end of the turn. It kind of worked out that we had all those cool skills on our Reaper to be able to pull that off. Like, otherwise, you can maybe get, you, you like, you would dash out there, try and maybe, you'd, you'd run into like a couple of pods for sure. You'd maybe get two crates. Three? Max? I don't know. Seems insane. Anyway, I'm very happy. We'll see you guys next time. Bye for now.